Azzy, congratulations on signing your first professional contract. How happy are you? I'm very happy. I joined this club from the age of eight and it's been a dream of mine to play football for my life uh, as a job and I really enjoy it. I think Azzy is one of our um, homegrown talents and it's important that we protect that. Um, but ultimately Azzy has, has earned that right. Um, over the last two seasons that I've worked with her, or a season and a half, um, she's, proven, she's proven what she's capable of. She's only at the very start of her career and I think it's really exciting, the sort of prospect um, and, and, and the potential that she has. Um, so we're delighted that, that, that we can sign Azzy on a long-term deal. And what kind of um, memories do you have of, of playing for Villa? Because obviously you said there you joined eight, so that's you know, a good yeah. ten years ago now. In my very first trial, um, went quite bad actually. My brother told me I played awful and it made me really sad but then I got the call and I was really happy to get in. I think it's the foundation of, of our team is to ensure that we give players opportunity that progress through our um, regional talent club and that our, well, that younger players can actually see the pathway and that there is a, there is a future at this football club and I think that you know our, our current first team um, that we have um, really sort of exemplifies that with Alicia and Dow, Jade Richards and, and players of that ilk that, that have come through the RTC. Um, so to be able to sign Azzy um, on that long-term deal, uh, again, just demonstrates our intent towards, towards younger players. And how do you kind of, um, obviously you made your debut, I think at the age of 16 maybe. Yeah. Um, so how kind of nice was it to have the club show that kind of faith in you and then you've pretty much been a regular ever since? Yeah, I was really surprised when they put me on. I didn't think I was going to play, um, but it was really exciting. I think I went on as a right wing back because we played wing back then, and it was quite fun, a bit stressful. I think it was against Durham, mm -hmm. and I didn't know who they were at the time, but now I do. They're like a rival, but it's good. Tell us a bit about what Azzy's like, kind of off the pitch as well as on the pitch. She's a, uh, a very bubbly personality, and she brings a lot of energy a lot of energy to the room when she walks in. Um, she just lights up the room, I think, and, and lifts people. Um, she's always smiling, always laughing, and she's just generally a, a lovely person to have around the camp. So how kind of happy we, then were you when you found out that obviously Gemma wanted to keep you here and they wanted to, to give you that contract? Very happy, thank you Gemma. <laughs> um, it's made me more confident in myself as well that they want to keep me for another two years. And um, how far do you think you, you know, she can kind of go um, in her career? Oh, I think we're all very excited as to, as to what she could achieve. Um, I think she's at the very sort of early stages of her career and I think you know, the last couple of seasons she's had so much senior experience, uh, which is only going to help her as she progresses, um, but also on the international stage as well with England, um, representing the 18s and also the 19s in the summer playing up an age group. All these experiences are going to be vital for her and her development moving forward. Um, but yeah, we're, we're all very excited as, as to where as to where Azzy will, will, will finish. Oh, how do you feel about coming through from the U Franks and what are your kind of main memories? And um, I feel like I've been at this club for ages and I'm like it's part of me. So um, I'd like to like. It's kind of a big dream, but I want to win the WSL with Aston Villa. And you've obviously seen how much the club have kind of invested in women's football as well and, mm -hmm. and kind Christian. of giving you guys that platform, so is that exciting for you? Uh, yeah, very. The facilities are really good here, better than bef like before we used to train here, but we didn't used to get to use the facilities as much, but now we get it all and it's really helped improve like the team, the use of the gym, made us stronger. You've only just turned 18, but you're kind of you're playing for England under 19s. You know, you've already made over 30 appearances for Villa. Do you kind of feel really happy about where you're at as a player and, and where you're going? Yeah, it feels quite normal to do all that, but then everyone else tells me it's like really good. And I already feel quite experienced in the team because I've played quite a few games. And it's just, I think I'm just developing as a player. And um, what does it kind of mean to you to, to pull on that Villa shirt and obviously you've been doing it since, since you were a youngster? I'm really proud. Um, Villa is like, you hear it and it's a big team and it makes me feel happy to say that I've played for them 